Okay, guys, this is gonna be brand stinking new system test six. Say goodbye to the shelf. It's not gonna be used anymore. Um, so all the alarms, there's still some things from the smoke. That alarm that was there, pole that was there. So, but you gotta change, don't we? So, this is the FAPS BG12, um, BG, uh, hold on a second. Okay, um, I looked inside, it's a BG12 MS, and we have a sign, yes, a sign. Look, yeah, I'm just putting this here, just for the sake, and a fire alarm sign, like usual, right there. And then here's how many batteries I have. I'll be making a power supply panel soon, so these won't be exposed. And now for the alarm in my room. FAPS uh, 8099-5020. Strobe by my company. And it's on 15 Gandela. I don't know if you can see that. But now the wires run up right behind that thing. Going up, going, it's going. A junction box will be there soon, I think, I don't know. It's going, it's going, and BAM! System Center 2400 TH, smoke and heat detector. If you're, no if you're noticing, there's something different. What happened to the thingy that was on the bottom where the heat is? Well, it fell off. When Whoever had it originally, like bent it so bad I was just putting it on my shelf and then like when I first put it up it just fell off hit the ground so I'm like oh man it broke so then I thought since I thought if that thing fell off the heat thing's activated and if that's activated it's activated for life well thank the lord um it's fine as you can see I don't know what it was for but I mean maybe it is for something but it's just messed up for the heat part but there it is like right there's my fan there's my room it's like right in the middle so if one of these things ever mess up it can detect so and let's follow the wire big herd wire uh, okay I thought I heard somebody something happened or somebody called my name the exit sign the emergency light now it's coming out here outside there's the wire. Spectral alert advance. Uh, P2W. Um, horn strobe on a 30, no, 15 candela, low volume, code 3. And now, what pulse station is this? The uh, BNJ1. Yep, have a pull station here now. Isn't that neat? Used to, they were over here. You can kind of see some marks. But now, I have it over here. I've always wanted a pull station right here. And the cool thing about the BNG1 series is this is fire on the side. So you can see. And there's the Spectre Alert. And I'm kind of particular. I really do not like red with white and white with red. I like white with white and red with red, even though the silver who really cares. I was originally going to put the BG-12, but I didn't really like the appearance with the Spectre Alert. There's my smoke alarm. Hardwire. Fire X. There's another one right there. Um, so yeah. Everything's on code 3. And let me check something. And we'll get this thing started. Okay, so you can still say goodbye to the shelf. I might put mini systems, I might not. Well, actually, no. I have a sneak peek real fast of my new mini system board I got for Christmas. And there it was. So, without further ado, let's get this party started. And this is my pull station. This is like my first BG-12, but I converted it to an FAPS. Um... FAPS BG12 MS. So, 
single action, as you can see. Um, I'll show you the inside before we start this. I know you're probably begging to hear this thing. Oh, and by the way, the Spectral Lord is on a low volume. Funny thing, I can hear it everywhere in my house, even outside. In my garage, you name it, I can hear it. And I'm, I can't even imagine what it would be. Like, if it was on high volume. And I have to use this little thingy, because the key doesn't work with it. I don't know why. FAPS alarms. Um, let's see if I can focus. There it goes. FAPS alarms, BG-12 series. Um, Non-coded, firearm box, firearm equipment. Model BG-12 MS. Um, SSD. And then it says... Right there, and there's a switch. And it's single action. And if you want me to make you one of these, you gotta send me one, but I'm still seeing, because I might show you how to make one, actually. I'll show you how to make one. So if you have a BG-12 that's beat up, whoops, that's beat up, you can just um, show it. I mean, not show it, just... You can show like on a how-to video, or me show how on a how-to video. And the reason I'm making it like at nine in the morning is because I'm out of school again. More snow, whoopee! And update about the stoplight. The green light burned out, so I'm gonna be doing a video on it. See if I can focus. There it goes. So and now this isn't focused. But yeah. Okay, enough yip yap. Let's pull the arm. Hold on one second. All right, I'm serious. Let's pull the alarm. Ready? I'm excited. I don't know why. Three, two, one. Loud. Oh my gosh, that is so loud. You can listen to that thing. Okay, let's be quiet. Hoo wee! Darn. Okay. Hmm, should I activate the smoke? I'll just activate it at the end. By the way, zone one, zone two, zone three. Now, let's pull this pull. Okay. Here we go. Find my notifier key. Here it is. Oh man, I don't want to do that. I don't like doing that. It messes it up. Um. So, yeah. Let me get my ladder and we'll test the smoke. Oh my gosh, you don't know how cold this ladder is. And I'm in my pajamas. I'm lazy. I mean, yeah, we're out of school, so why not? Get my tester. Oh my gosh, I really need socks on. You don't know how cold these steps are. And there's the exit sign. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why, I can't, why do I keep saying yeah? Well, I know why, because I can't get this tester out. Oh, I can't, I can't even focus with this, um... Stupid ladders freezing. Okay, no. I really need to get a new iPad case. Let's see if it's ready. Yep. It's not really blinking. I don't know what's with the camera. It's not blinking at all. It's fine. Oh crap, you know it. 
I need to open a pole station. There's a key. Ow. There we go. Alright, so that was system test six. See ya.